Yo, what is good squad? I am Mike from Michael's Jays, and today we are doing an unboxing and review on an all-star weekend shoe that drops on February 15th of 2020 in Chicago at the all-star game. You are looking at the Jordan 3 Red Cement, AKA Unite. First things first, before we get into the review, I want to thank all the old subscribers that joined the squad in 2019 and for everybody in 2020. Welcome to Michael's Jays. I appreciate you for stopping by. I hope you enjoy the content that I'll be giving you today. Also, if you guys can go head on over to Michael's Jays on Instagram, that is where I put my content that is most recent first, even before I get it to YouTube. So if you'd like to know what's coming to Michael's Jays in 2020, head on over to Instagram, at Michael's Jays, hit me with some likes. Also hit this video with some likes and put the comments down below. Let's engage into some uh, conversations here in 2020. I just wanna send a big thank you out to every single person that has given me support throughout the six months that I've been doing this and it's been an awesome journey so far. Well, big news today, Michael's Jays is now open on Etsy. I did start my own clothing brand. So again, if you'd guys like to see that, I'll on the next clips I'll put some video imaging right here. But if you guys would like to see what's coming to Michael's Jays clothing line in 2020, head on over to my Instagram as well or go to Etsy and just type in Michael's Jays. You'll find me there. Right now we have four. So again, I appreciate every single one of you guys. Thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. And let's get back into this review. Well, now with all that out of the way, let's get into the review here. We do have, as you guys can see, the Jordan 3 Unite which comes out February 15th of 2020, which is the All-Star Weekend. This sneaker is a Jordan 3. It is basically a black cement, but in red. So that is why they are dubbing it Red Cement, but its name is called Unite, and it does have the writing on the inside of the paper saying Unite on it. So it does have that special paper, also the special box, that is included with it. That's pretty cool. I'm glad they did something special for All-Star Weekend 2020. And here it is. Your 2020 Jordan 3 Unite. So what Jordan Brand decided to do with this sneaker here was, is they wanted to make it true to its OG form from 1988 and they did change a couple of things on this sneaker here that I'm about to run through and show you. Now in 2018, they did drop a Black Cement 3, which predominantly was black, where everything here is red, it was black. And these eyelets here, they are black on this, but on the Black Cement, they are red. I will put out a comparison video of the two, but right now, this is just gonna be the review of this sneaker. But what I wanna show you is the OG hits that they actually put on the sneaker. In the 2018 version, they have the sock liner, which is this, all the way to the top and over the edge of this. In the OG form on this one, they brought the leather all the way up. And the sock liner is actually still on the inside of the sneaker, just like it was on the OGs for 1988. So now let's get to the front of the sneaker. As you can see, it is tumbled leather and it is very plush and nice and soft. They do have a smooth leather around the bottom where your mud guard is. Basically your whole sneaker is fire red, fire red, cement gray and black. That is what they're labeling this. The only thing that I've noticed is that the elephant print isn't the same for each sneaker. You see how the elephant print is different? This is the right sneaker than the left. Now it is only different on my mud guard. I did see a video by Fomer Simpson, which was dropped today, and his elephant print was different on the back but mine seems to be the same on the back, but the elephant print in the front is different. You see what I'm saying? See how this is more pronounced 
it's popping out more. It's also bigger. This one is a lot smaller and doesn't pop as much. It's also not as dark. The elephant print is not consistent with one another. And I don't know if you know that bothers you. It really doesn't bother me because it makes it you know unique. And if you try to go and return it, you're probably gonna get a pair that's even worse or somewhere around the same. You do get a set of red laces and white laces and they do come with the black already laced up on there. I probably won't be using the red because that is just a little bit too much red. The white, I just don't think that'll even look right. So I'm probably just gonna keep it stocked. Leave a comment down below, tell me what you guys think. Are you gonna be rocking red, white, or black? So with that being said, we are now at the end of the video. It's the on feet. So I'm about to stick these guys on my feet for you, show you how I'm gonna rock it with a couple different pairs of pants or joggers. You guys now made it to the end of the video. I just wanna say thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed my take on the 2020 Jordan 3 Unite, AKA Red Cement. Also, if you guys could go and make that red subscribe button over there gray and beat that bell icon in the face for me. Again, you don't wanna miss the fire that I'll be coming out with in 2020. Again, also, go follow all my socials via Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and my new Etsy store that just opened up. So I would appreciate if you guys went and dropped some likes and comments. Again, let's engage in some conversations in 2020 and let's push out Michael's J's to let it grow. So again, thank you very much. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for the on feats because those shits are the best. Again, you guys have yourself a great day. Thanks for stopping by. I'm out. Peace.